The piece in the window is a structure. Uh, it's made out of bubblegum and uh, polyurethane rubber. Each brick is cast individually. Uh, it resembles like a short tower. I see it kind of like a swarm. It actually came from a couple different things. It came, one being an interest in structures, both uh, man-made and natural. The other being an interest in biology. I like to look at color and pattern in the natural world, like how a different species uses color and pattern as an aid in their survival or even, or even reproduction. Some years ago I thought about how can I play with different materials to get me something close to that, something that's lifelike, fleshy. This rubber can look like skin, tissue, uh, it looks like fat, it does lead itself to being lifelike. Making the bricks, uh, it just is a, a number of, of wooden molds I've made and uh, I line them with Vaseline as my release agent. The studio always has some sort of smell going on. I do use a lot of resins. But for the most part, it's a little bit of uh, toxicity that you walk into every time. I wanted it so a person of average size can look and see that there is that it is hollow, or at least get under tippy toes and see that it is hollow and that was important for me. It is, and it is keeping within the size of, of, you know, a human. It was natural for me to think about uh, the, the bubblegum and, and rubber because it does have a pop to it. And my hope there is that it does uh, get someone's attention, get them to that window, and, you know, hopefully they could ask some questions. It's fitting to be in a city like this, full of bricks, to, to be able to look through the window and stare at some that are a little bit different.